Hi, hello, and welcome to The Shot Clock alongside Rick Moore and Diamondbacks Sometimes Insider and Coyotes Expert. We've got to get a shorter title for that. <laughs> uh, it's just it reads out there on the screen real nicely. I'm Jay, and uh, let's start the clock. Okay, Rick, we have Jake Lamb on the shelf. Um, some uncertainty into what's going on. I know that he's uh, been looked at by some medical professionals, none of whom are left-handed. All right, there you go. Tell me a little <laughs> bit about what you think is going on and, and what's the timetable here? So initially, it looked like Jake Lamb was hopeful to return uh, for the Diamondbacks' upcoming road trip that begins on Tuesday in Philadelphia, but manager Tori Lavulo announcing after Sunday's game at Chase Field that Jake Lamb has right elbow tendinitis. He's been rehabbing a shoulder injury, so a little disconcerting to see that he has a different injury. Uh, Lamb had been playing in extended spring training all last week, played in the field three times, ramped up to a nine-inning stint at one point. Seemed like he was feeling good, but he'll now be shut down for a couple days, will be reevaluated on Wednesday. Uh, says that MRI found some inflammation in that throwing elbow. Not the greatest news, but then again, the Diamondbacks have won all seven of their series to start the season. First team in 15 years to do that. Um, what are some other potential problem areas? I know they've been waiting on Steven Souza. Anything update here? Yeah, Souza is looking promising. He began throwing for the first time on Sunday, and uh, the Diamondbacks will uh, probably evaluate him today. Uh, the training staff, he, he's not traveling with the team, so they'll evaluate him today. And it, the hope is that Souza will continue to play in extended spring training over at Salt River Fields uh, over this next week, and hopefully he'll be ready to return. But uh, when he began throwing last time a couple weeks ago, I think it was about 10 days ago, uh, he began feeling some discomfort in that torn right pectoral. So hopefully that doesn't happen again, and Susan can continue on along that rehab. Yeah, it'd be nice to actually see the guy in action at mm -hmm. some point. Um, finally today, uh, Rick's working on a, a very important survey on Diamondbacks uniforms, and you talked to almost the entire team. Yes. Look for that sports.azcentral.com later today. What uniform combo is the best, according to the players, for Rick? I'm Jay. Have a great day.